What Artyom been up to here? How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. He radioed from the ring, said he'd be here tomorrow. <laughs> hey, you! Leave him alone! I killed him myself nah. with my slingshot. <laughs> Let him learn to stand up for himself. Ah, yeah, How right. else can he hope it's to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now? said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel. Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop! There's only Metro, nothing else. And the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me. So, get ready to go. Then, we'll discuss your transfer to Polis. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom, please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are damn good. They brought Archeon here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Nah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Eh? Well, sadly, it's their job. Job or no job, if they keep doing that. Well, not everyone can stand being cooped up down here. And why not? It's what's kept us alive up to now. Huh. And how long do you think that's going to last? How many kids are there in the station? In the whole metro? Who will be left here in ten years? Ten years? We'll be lucky if we make it halfway there. No antibiotics, no suture threat. Which is why we can't afford to have our best fighters taking unnecessary risks. What will we do if all the Spartans come down with radiation poisoning like Artyom and the Nazis try something?
<laughs> Uncle Artyom, don't worry. I believe you. <laughs> Will you take me with you when you find the clean place outside? <laughs> And those keep getting larger, stronger, and smarter by the day. Sooner or later, they will Artyom, cautious. stop Sooner putting delusions the into his head. I don't want him going crazy like you. Uh, I'm not sure I can't even sleep since you told him all those silly so stories. But <sighs> Is that supposed to make him better? Please, leave my son alone. Something that will save us. I don't know. I doubt there is any magical salvation out there. What could possibly have survived on the surface after all these years? The only real solution would be total evacuation. But where would we go? So, what are you proposing? Artyom, just try to take better care of yourself, huh? Even if you find someone else out there, they probably have their own troubles. So what would contacting them even accomplish? Besides, I remember we used to receive signals from the outside pretty frequently soon after the bombs fell. But not for a long time now. Doesn't that tell you anything? Ah well, it's your life. Artyom, I understand how you feel, but you are not always going to save the Metro single-handedly. Why keep looking for a solution alone? Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom! You're all right! You Move, gave us a Artyom. scare, brother! Artyom! How are you, friend? I Arthur, see you, right. gentlemen! Give way! This calls for a celebration! Artyom. A few more scars and you'll be completely irresistible to any woman! Speaking of which, Hello, Asha. You are the nurse's son, son of the huh? You just stopped crowding him. Brother. Bring him back, Artyom. Ah, ah, Priviat, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! <laughs> oh, yeah. it's official. Yeah, I knew it. You guys are like kids. So I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. Ticking. <sighs> Why, yes, and there's also those damn things calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? Silent, Artyom, because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Come on, replace your filter. Haven't you spent enough time in the sick bay? Time. Time to replace our filters. Move it. We don't need any extra radiation, darling. Oh, Father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off-limit zone. Have you been to all these ruins? See all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. There's 
just no way anything can live up here but the monsters. Look, maybe you should come back to the Order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. Your turn now. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa! Hear that? from the roof and decided to ambush us. The beasts are getting smarter. Let's pick up the pace. Now the whole area knows we're here. off limits to stalkers. The radiation and beasts are nothing special. Stop. The pack is here. So, do we turn this place into Thermopylae, or do we let them pass? Wait it out. Looks like that was all of them. I'm glad they didn't notice us. That was a large pack. why the zone is off limits? I mean, if all the packs here are like that. Look! It's our guns from the Order! 
You should have checked first, assholes! Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one for that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we'll tell the whole Metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back. Let's go. <sighs> <sighs> 